Hello, today I'm going to show you how to recognize and execute the 4G perms. So here I've laid out the 4G perms in order A, B, C, D. All G perms have a block. So a block is two pieces next to each other like this. So all the G perms have this block and in all the other sides there's no blocks. So all you have to do is find that block and then we'll go to the next step. So first, if the block is on the right side like this, like if you're facing the block and the block is on the right side, that means that it's either GA perm or GB perm. And if the block is on the left, it's either C or D. Let's start with the A and B. So we know that the block is on the right. And to differentiate be between them, on GA perm, on the right side, the opposite colors, in this case green and blue, are away from each other on opposite ends of the cube. And in the G P GB perm, the opposite colors are adjacent to each other like this. So that's all you need to know to recognize A and B. Now on to C and D. The blocks are on the left side this time. And just now, in the A and B, you're looking for the opposite colors on the right side, right? In the C and D, you're looking at the left side. So in G, C perm, the opposite colors are on opposite ends, so like on the corners here. And on the G, D perm, the opposite colors are adjacent to each other like this. Now let's move on to execution. So this is a GA perm. Remember, the block is on the right side and opposite colors are on opposite ends. Algorithm will be placed here and yeah, let's execute it. So basically, you grip it like this with two fingers here and your thumb here. So you bring it up, do a UW with your index finger, R prime, and then use sort of your like fourth finger I guess to push U, and then do another R prime like that, U prime with your left index finger, and then R, UW prime with your left index finger and R2. Then you can do F prime UF like this. Or you can rotate and do R prime U R. So let's do that one more time. Again, R2, U W, and then push with your a lot of your fingers. Okay. Now let's look at it executed quickly. This is the G B perm, so block on the right, opposite colors adjacent to each other. So on the first G perm, we execute it from here. But in this case, we have to uh, do a Y prime. Yes, Y prime. And then do this algorithm. Again, it will be p placed over here. R prime, grip it like this, R prime U prime R. And then U and D prime same time using these two fingers like that. And then regrip R2. Now here you have a choice. You can do a U with your index finger like that, like that, or like this with your right finger. I prefer doing this. And then U R prime U R U prime R U prime R2 and then one more time. So again, R prime U prime R, same time, and then recrib R to U like that. Now let's look at it, execute it quickly. This is the G C perm. It's really nice. So the bar on the left and opposite colors 
on opposite ends of the cube. So this time you face the block and you do this algorithm. The execution is pretty straightforward, but let's look at it again more slowly. So grip it like this, R2 prime, then F2 like that, R right hand double flick, R left hand double flick, and then R prime F, sexy move, R prime F again, and then R2. Now let's look at it, execute it quickly. This is the GD firm. It's by far my favorite G firm out of the four. So again, block on the left and opposite colors adjacent to each other. This time we're facing the opposite colors and we do this algorithm. So this is very similar to the GB perm, it's just mirrored. So um, we started off like R U R prime, and then U and D at the same U prime and D at the same time with your left hand like this, and then R two like that. Don't regrip. U prime R U prime, and then R prime U R U using your pinky and your fourth finger and then R2 and the AUF is like that. Let's do it one more time. So R U R prime, U prime D and then do not regrip. Fourth and fifth finger, R2, AUF. Now let's look at it, execute it quickly. <laughs> 